Hi, I'm Arnie Calvert, the editor of Social Forces, an international journal of social research that's published by Oxford University Press. I'm here in New York City today uh, to attend the annual meeting of the American Sociological Association, and I'm joined today by Dr. Jürgen Schupp, who is at the German Institute for Economic Research and is also the director of the world-famous socioeconomic panel in Germany. Uh, Germany is one of our affiliates uh, of social forces, and so welcome to our conversation. Thank you. So the, uh, the theme of this year's uh, sociological meetings is interrogating inequality, right. which highlights the importance of inequality and the mechanisms that uh, have uh, driven it. To what extent is inequality an important area of research in Germany? development of uh, inequality um, is under political and also on public um, uh, observation. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know in September there will be elections in Germany uh, right. and the issue of uh, rising inequality and is there a price of inequality um, is a hot issue all, of all the uh, parties. And uh, uh, so social justice and rising inequality within Germany, but also, of course, within Europe, mm -hmm. um, is a hot issue. And uh, there are uh, dark sides also of coming, uh, of rising inequality. In the past, rising inequality was just uh, a matter of, well, it's the price of uh, rising GDP, then uh, inequality comes together. Mm -hmm. But it's all for, for everybody. Mm -hmm. But the new theme, I think, is uh, if we observe that rising inequality comes together with lowering mobility, yeah, lowering mobility and uh, lower chances for getting up uh, into uh, um, uh, the status of uh, uh, um, uh, wealth and uh, income and jobs, then I think uh, also the German um, consensus comes in real trouble. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, there are uh, also at that conference, I think, rich contributions to, to find out more on the mechanisms within the family, uh, within different talents, um, uh, within different uh, uh, countries and uh, welfare states, mm -hmm. uh, to disentangle the different mechanisms that are driven by just the economy just uh, the family uh, surroundings and culture, and of course uh, the uh, policy uh, issues uh, to, to, uh, to help um, uh, families to, to get mobile and to, to get uh, an, an increase in their careers. Great. Are there any other issues that are particularly important in sociological research in Germany these days? Well, I think uh, the, the work-life balance, to bring together um, uh, family and uh, uh, work and development and the, the, the um, uh, uh, um, uh, rising um, uh, wish to, to participate in the labor, labor force, especially for, for women, um, uh, is a hot issue. And to, uh, to, uh, to um, um, and uh, another theme is, of course, uh, the integration of uh, um, uh, um, immigrants and uh, people with uh, migration background. Mm -hmm. um, you know, there, there is a, was a lot, lot influx in, also in Germany uh, after the wall came down, down and the collapse of the um, Soviet Union. Uh, a lot of native Germans came into Germany and we are an aging uh, society as many societies mm -hmm. in, in Europe, so we need, of course, influx. Mm -hmm. And uh, within um, uh, uh, the European actual debate also on uh, the strengths of Germany, but also the, the uh, problems of the southern European uh, countries. Uh, uh, there, there is the uh, influx uh, rising also uh, on, on mobility uh, from southern uh, Europe to, to, uh, to the northern mm -hmm. uh, European countries. Uh, Heterogeneity is not a problem, it's fine. I think for pluralistic um, uh, uh, countries, um, uh, pluralistic ways of, of living. Um, freedom is uh, coming together with uh, heterogeneous ways of living, but mm -hmm. as soon as um, uh, heterogeneity comes into structured inequality mm -hmm. and diminishing mobility patterns that mm -hmm. children uh, of uh, families with low income have lower ch chances to get uh, their, mm -hmm. their talents uh, um, uh, um, uh, to the to the labor market, right. then I think our society runs into a real problem. How do uh, people in Germany, uh, in sociologists, uh, are how how are they connected to the global community of scholars? What ways do they uh, communicate with international uh, groups of scholars? Well, conferences like this okay. uh, to okay. come to uh, come to conferences to to uh, publish and to uh, apply for uh, other colleagues from mm -hmm. other countries mm -hmm. and especially in Europe, we have. 
great uh, funding uh, sources on the European level, so right. European um, uh, work is mm -hmm. uh, fostered. Um, and of course, yeah, other things uh, that are um, uh, o uh, boards of overseers mm -hmm. or uh, that you really cooperate with, with your special team. And okay. like the panel study of income dynamics, we have a, um, a cross-national equivalent file initiative. So right. that means we were working together with other global um, uh, longitudinal panel studies worldwide. Right. Um, and uh, that is that are the forums of uh, cooperation. Are there any articles in social forces that you have found particularly interesting in recent years? Well, uh, first I, I want to mention the the, the the article that I liked most at uh, years ago. It was from uh, by uh, uh, an article with a with a little help uh, of uh, with a little help of my friends. It okay. was on social networks by okay. Andy Graf. Okay, uh, and it was an eighty eighty or something like yeah, that. That yeah. was. I was paid attention. Well, this uh, magazine that is a uh, striking article. But in, in recent years, uh, there was an, an article um, on on the uh, emotional um, um, issues of inequality. I think it was. I just have to look. Um, Jessica Collette. Um, yeah. It was in uh, 2010 okay. where she was uh, writing on occupational status and the experience of anger. Oh. Bring emotional. Um, uh, um, uh, effects and also s social structural inequality together and to look whether uh, inequality also has a, um, a very personal emotional flavor. Um, so that was a, a, a striking article and of course the work uh, that was just recently published by, by Janet Gornick uh, oh, yes. with, a, with a less right. this, uh, data right. and Liz is uh, well it's like the, the cross-national Luxembourg income study, right? And it's a, a, a very comparative um, uh, and income-driven data, but her um, contribution was to, to look not only on the money, but also on the time. Absolutely. And uh, not only on the uh, yearly time you invest, but also on the, 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 the um, uh, monthly and weekly time schedule. Right. So time is also, I think, a big issue, issue. Um, uh, for, for further research. Jürgen, thank you so much for having Howdy. this conversation. It was and a pleasure. Uh, have a thank good you. trip back to Germany. Thank you. Okay.